It's Monday. It's early. My voice has that early sound to it. How are we doing? Puyakaku. Pukayaku. Pukayaku. Pukayaku to you too. Where are we? Is this Brazil or Mexico? How was your weekend? They're selling gasoline, mobile jimmies, and gas. Okay. Good to know. I still don't know where the hell this is. Give me a capital so I can go from there. Puma de Oro. They sell Oreos there, huh? Or is that gold? I don't know. I'm not holding on, but holding out much hope for this guess. I don't have much confidence in myself today. You can kind of get that. Like when I was a kid, I would study for things, but then I would uh, usually know going into it how I felt. To be like, this feels like I got this test. I don't need to study. I, I'm going to do fantastically well on it. I feel super confident. And then there'll be times where I'm studying like, none of this is, I'm not retaining any of this. No matter how much I study, I'm just, I feel like I'm going to get a bad grade in this. And then I sit there and uh, end up actually comparing the notes between the ones I'm actually confident in, or the scores I'm actually confident in, and the ones I'm not. And I tend to actually do better on the ones, even if I didn't study anywhere near as much as the other ones. Two way better one on the ones that were confident. Now, whether or not that was confident because I knew this stuff, or just confident that I uh, didn't feel like I needed to study as much, that my brain just had it, I don't know. So, last time I tried to figure out where the hell this was, I went by these being a Filipino thing, and that destroyed me. This That's probably like 80 fucking episodes ago at this point. <clears throat> so, I don't know if that's going to hold much water here. Ah. <sighs> Fernandez Auto. See, this could either be like Brazil, Colombia, or the Philippines. I'm not seeing anything of either choice that's going to help me. And I'm a little pressed for time here. Like, I Poyak, Poyaka, Pokayu. Pokayaku. Pokayaku. I can't say it. I, it's not like a word that screams this country. And no one has any flags up anywhere. That doesn't help. They got coconuts. So it's along the equator. Or at least a tropical region. Nothing helping me there. 58 seconds. Oh my Christ. I see a scoreboard here, potentially. This may have... Oh, nope. It's something... Oh, man, I am so scared about what this is going to turn into. Like, I feel like I should do Central America and then easily have this turn out to be friggin'... Philippines. I, I don't know. Jose Rojas Bailon. Juanco Tocache. I feel like that's here. There's the equator. I'm going to say... I'm going to say here. And I'm going to make guess because this is going to be bad anyway. No, it was farther south. Okay, we were in Peru. Uh, at least I didn't pick Philippines and have it blow up in my face. Does it actually say Poyak? Poi ya poi kayaku poi kayaku I can't I can't those words cannot come together in my head refuses to it's like when I was a kid and I tried to say caterpillar and I would go caterpillar I'm like yeah I know what I'm supposed to say it's just not coming out that way so these gas prices however jank it looks in the photo. Makes me feel this is Europe. They do things by liter, and the number is very high, I think. I don't remember. This is a sports club, but they spell it with a K. I don't trust k clubs that start with K. Well, it's beer garden, so this is potentially 
Germany. Where in Germany? I don't know. Star Promamen. I've had that before. Star Promamen. I believe I had that when I was in Macedonia. This does not feel like Macedonia anymore. Because it's .cz. No, I had Star Promamen because Evo brought that back one time from the Czech Republic. All right. Okay, at least I got this country right. It's tiny enough. I'll get a decent score. Let's see if I can pick. I'm going to see if I can actually see where he's from on here. I don't remember exactly what direction it is, but it's a bit of a drive from Pregu. I'm going to click here for now. I'll do Venezuela. Maybe it's closer to the German border because it's called a beer garden. Although that means nothing at all. <clears throat> Potra Vini. It would be funny if this actually does turn out to be this, the town he's from. I'll have to call him and let him know if it turns out to be that. Oh, come on, give me, give me like a street, a road, a highway sign. This would be very helpful. This is what I needed. All right. Lipova. Lipova. All right, let's look for Lipova. It is not this high out. Um, here we go. Looking, looking, looking. I'm just looking at border towns to see if it's there. I mean, this isn't a very big country, so. Okay. I feel like I've seen Lipova before. I feel like I say that a lot. I mean, like, I think I've seen it. And it never turns out that way. Um, do not Lipova or Velki Senov. I got a minute, so we're just going to sit here and look at this for right now. No, if you've seen it already, good for you. Give yourself 5,000 points. Because you have better eyes than me. And i that is a problem I have. Where I'm not able to ever see things if I don't think they're there like if I'm looking for my keys and I'm like I they're not on my desk and then my brain's like okay ignore anything on desk even if it looks like keys don't look at it and then I tell everybody hey I can't find my keys and then they come into my room and they find them and they're right on the desk like really it's like I swear I've looked there 16 times and they're not there his brains are so frustrating or maybe I'm just like complaining. I don't see it anywhere here. Krasna, I feel like I just saw Krasna. I have like, like whatever, um, constant, constant, uh, repetitive deja vu with things. It was up here. There was no way. I wasn't even looking up here. Well, we were in, uh, what was it called? Vilmov. That's still part. Oh God, fucking Google, stop frustrating me so much. Oh, there is that little nugget in the north there. Oh, that would explain why it's got a little bit of German there. Although the country itself isn't all that big. This may tell me everything I need right now. It told me one thing. That's a flag. Potentially a flag, but it's just... Not in very good condition. Um, seeing these here tell me nothing. Like that sign is uh, it's like Hulu. I don't know what any of this means. I'm going to go 200 meters this way. Although this is probably the entrance to the thing they're talking about. That is the Malaysian flag. All right. Here we go. Now, Malaysia, okay, it's all of this minus Brunei. It's not Singapore, it's Malaysia. You have it right. Don't double guess yourself. We're going to click here. See, that's not saying it's Singapore. Malaysia is all of this and all of this minus that. Riau Island. Okay, so we've got the, we've got the country. This is, unless that guy is from Malaysia. And then it's just like, 
I, I'm not Malaysia anymore. I'm just repping the country I'm from. This could very well subvert everything I know. But they do use English words here. Uh, this this type of like flag, I feel that's a flag, and it's just like either it hasn't been used in a long time or rotted away or something. Are they playing soccer, or is it like high lie? No, I don't. I can't tell what they're. It's like tennis, but I don't think any of them have rackets, and they're using their feet. All right, maybe this will help me a bit more, but I can't make out any of that. All right, nope. All right, this has more flag. Okay, we've got the Malaysian one there. I don't know what either of these two are. Maybe it's a school? I don't know. This. Nothing here. All right. Um, I'm just going to see if I can... Hey, it's, it's clearly... See, this country gets it. You put your flags up everywhere to help people playing GeoGuessr. I'm going to see... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh, I tried to get that as far away from the mic as possible and not hold it in because I don't want to rupture my esophagus. No, thank you. I found that listening to too many things on, on the radio is making me too paranoid to the point where... Well, not... Not to the point where I don't want to do anything anymore. I'm going to put us over here or kind of split the difference because, uh, whatever. Commit to, commit to one. I mean, it's a long, wide country, and I think you're going to get a bad score if you're on the wrong island, but I got the country. That's all I'm happy about. Like, I went hiking yesterday. Very scenic. I wish I could have taken the drone, but number one, I wasn't able to get it to work on my phone satisfactorily, and I didn't want to sit there trying to fly it by sight and have it get out of vision, and I'm like, I don't know where the fuck this thing went. Oh my god, it's gone now. And I didn't... It was raining, so I didn't want that to happen to it. And it's not mine, so if any of that stuff happened to it, it's... You know, I'm using somebody else's very expensive piece of electronic equipment. And I don't want to be responsible for things breaking on it. So, a lot of the things I wanted to use this drone for over the summer I haven't been able to because both hikes have been raining. Oh, I did get the country. Okay, it was Malaysia. Well, I'll give it four stars. I'm feeling generous today. We got a sign back here. What's this one say? But, Leon. Well, I know where Leon is. It's Spanish? I believe. Leon. Alright. N6201. There's the 601. And the LE213. And it's the 601. And the N120. I, okay, I'm, go, I'm going... To do this math right now. It's a green sign. But. It's probably combined with a SEP. LE232. <laughs> Excuse me. I got the sniffles from the one sneeze. There's the 213. To Brad Defus. Okay there's that. That takes you this way. So we're like. Here. Potentially. I just need to find the 120 to, like, nail this down. Like, right there, maybe? We're on an exit ramp, I think. Grad FS is if you take... Oh, let's look at it again. Grad FS is up there. So if you take... That, it will take you there, but it's like far enough away. No, it's got to be like right here. Let's, yeah, I think maybe actually like right here. Is there like anything visual? Free rest area for pilgrims. All right, let's, let's take a look. Is that a rest area for pilgrims? It looks like a end of a street. Let's back up a bit. 
Look at this sign. Look at this sign. This is probably just saying kilometer marker. Camino de Santiago. Is there anything that looks like a Camino del Santiago here? I'm not seeing it. I think I've got this. I should jump over to that side road there and just see if I can't see like a, a, a local street. Here we go. All right, so I'm on here. Okay, we're at the end of this road here. It's like there's no back, and I feel like someone just put a hand down and plopped your car here, and then you're starting on the racetrack. All right, restaurant, commas. All right, do we have a restaurant, commas, around here? Let's see if I can't. And area. Like, I. Fiona Casablanca. I don't know. I'm sticking where I have it for now. I feel like this is a hostel of some sort, maybe. We're gonna. We're. I'm. I'm keeping it here. I'm feeling satisfactorily confident in my decision and choice. All right, we got Valladolid. Let's get a bit more. Do the 120 to get to Valladolid. Let's zoom out to see how far away Valladolid is. Valladolid is not showing up. 601. Grad I got 5,000 points. I 100% nailed a goddamn Spanish choice. I was nine yards away. Oh, I feel so good. Five stars. Thank you. All I needed. All right. Again, stop doing five stars because then they um, retributionally. I got to find a way to make that a better word. Retribulates you into a very questionable location that seems potentially impossible to find information. I thought that set a sign. This may be the only nugget of information I'm going to get. And of course, you blur it out, you mother... Kilometer 3,882. Well, fuck me. This is a long strip of road. Very messy. I'm going to say this is... Chile or Peru. Although, these bridges with the white on it make me think it's Mexico. Hello. Very rundown sign. Tell me the things I want to hear. Universidad Nacional Des Chorizo. Doesn't help. This is a very long strip of road. This must have been fun to pave. All right, what's this is blur you I don't know why you feel the need to blur these out. Three hundred and eighty one. You are on the non English colony driving side of the car. Oh, I'm not feeling good about this at all. Hopefully we can get to that truck. Because this is potentially Chile, Argentina, maybe Mexico. <laughs> Chile, Cito. I almost want to say that's we're in Chile. But I don't know if Chile, Cito is like a Brand name of a uh, ice cream or something. You thought I was gonna say hot sauce. I don't culturally, whatever the word you want to use to yell at me for. I I'm not gonna say it. Entrada. It. Why would the entrance that way? I don't know. Motel Los Pinos. The Hotel of Penis. Sounds fun. What do we have here? Sounds inviting. Hey, a sign. I went too far. All right. All right. Road sign. Road sign. Further. Chile Cite. I'm going to just put us on Chile. CTO. The, fuck me if I know what the hell. 
I almost thought it was that, but it's not. Um, this is a very long strip of road, which I'm going to say is Highway 5. We're, we're on the side of a very arid highway. Deserty here with mountain range on the side. That's mostly along this side here. So I'm just going to click here for now. And then let's see what happens. I hope I've got this, like, the country red at least. I know I'm not going to get a very good score. Just because... It's, a. Uh, I have 20 seconds to get by this truck. This truck better have every piece of information I want and need. Administration Municipal Dill VL Cow. Um, the Alley Dad. I was okay. That's twice Google. I don't care. Hit the button again. This actually wasn't in Chile. It was Argentina. I just got lucky that it was close enough. Give me four thousand. What's this highway? San Nicolas. All right, five stars. Take that. And a uh, strong start to the week, except for that choice, but that one was pretty difficult. Uh, I'd like to thank you all for watching on this wonderful Monday. I hope you guys are going to have a great week. Or if you're just watching this in se sequence on the, uh, whatever it's called on YouTube, when there's a series of the same video in a row. I can't think of it right now because it's early. I can't think. But like, favorite, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Everyone else on YouTube asks you to do. Um, this week, I think I might do these three more times and then maybe change it next week. I'm not entirely sure, but if you guys got a preference, let me know because I'll keep doing this, but if you want me to mix it up, chop it up, whatever you want to call it, thinking about doing that too. But uh, I don't know what's going to happen for the rest of the week again. Uh, it's just me as usual, but uh, it'll be interesting. I'm trying at least anyway, but until next time, have a good one, folks. We will see you very soon.